Alright, this is uh, the part where we actually reconnect the wire. So I have the area cleaned up. I have the wires uh, preconditioned. I got some solder on them. And I have a piece of shrink tubing on one of my wires. Now, I have to work quickly here because the shrink tubing does not like heat. If I put my soldering iron for on too long, it will warm up the wire and shrink my tube. All right. See the tube has shrunk already a little bit. And I don't like that. So, I have to check my Okay, looks all right. Now I just have to force my shrink tubing. Okay, connection is not perfect, but it's metal. We can adjust it a little bit. actually don't have to use the shrink tubing here. Not critical. Especially because it's so damn difficult to get it on such small scale to work just the way you want it to. Okay. Work with me here. Get on there. I'm gonna cut it. Cut that piece that shrunk. That's where the problem is. A little piece that shrunk. Alright, see? Now it's all better. Okay. Now, um, I could just use my iron, iron to warm it up and shrink around my wire. Okay. All right, this will create a good separation on the inside. So now I don't have my Apple device here so I can't test it but uh, since there was only one broken uh, wire in there I'm not too worried and I'm not too worried about all these frayed wires And I'm actually not worried about reconnecting them together because there is the um, there is a wire that's uh, going right through. So okay, I'm not gonna do anything. What I will do is I got a couple more pieces of uh, shrink tubing, and uh, we are going to strengthen everything hopefully okay this will be a problem how do I pull it through oh my god I made it too long okay I know how to do it there is a trick there is always a trick we can just insert oh, something more prominent Well, this I didn't prepare for. I'll be back.